means you guys. You guys were the ladies. It was a joke. My name is Zoe Castillo, and I'm alive. Welcome back to The Way Back and The Way Forward. No, that's just branches. Okay, this is Dreamfall, this is episode 31. 31? I don't know. I honestly don't know if I've had any series on this channel that reached this many episodes maybe dvz maybe mic but but this is going to be definitely the longest uh, series which is fine because it's the longest journey right so works out in the end let's move forward uh, actually let's look at stuff let's make sure our protagonist has to descend into terrifying darkness rather than walk into a brightly lit flowery glade yeah I mean this is pretty there is fireflies I don't I just don't complain I cannot get back I can just I can look at this burned down house I could see in the distance over there before and then they've got that whole normal things that should look quaint and safe except they look horrifically scary thing down to a fine art yeah that's a not at all reassuring shade of black and what are those swirling things giant tadpoles i don't want to know naked twisting branches blocking what little light there is check okay very mate very meta <laughs> This is all very grim. I'm expecting an evil queen and a sleeping beauty at any time. If this was the entrance to a haunted house, I'd say they'd gone overboard. It is pretty spooky. Not gonna lie. Whoa, shit! Mother of ravens! I don't feel very welcome. I mean, this isn't just a bad sign. It's all the bad signs, all at once, like a grab bag of ill oh. omens. There are plenty mm. of stones lying about. Let's just pick one and pretend it's the soul stone. It's not like anyone would know what it's supposed to look like. Where are you, Crow? This <laughs> is like talking to me. I never saw you. Oh my god, I have definitely peaked the mic there. <laughs> Genuinely scared. It's like it's one of it's you don't expect a jump scare in a horror game you expect a jump scare so they're not as good not as effective but this game I did not affect the jump scare effect expect I did not effect even the plants down there look like like dead hands wiggling their cold dead fingers welcome to nature prepare to be terrified that's a not at okay, all reassuring shade of black and what are those swirling things giant tadpoles uh, I don't want to know hey this looks like one of those pivotal moments where the audience is yelling at the heroine don't go through the gate are you crazy well yeah but then again we cannot get back try glad I have crow here regardless of how useless he may be at times he's still company I'll take company over no company anytime ah! oh my tiny bird heart I have a bad feeling about this Zoe Oh, there's many cats. That's so not reassuring. And I used to like nice kitties. Nice, red-eyed, terrifying kitties. There's one here, too. Oh, there's... That's so not there's reassuring. There's one sticking out... And I used to like cats. ...from the rocks. Nice kitties. Oh, there's a lot nice, of them. Nice, red-eyed, terrifying kitties. Cool! I'm glad I missed that jump scare, though, because I, I looked at the gate. <laughs> Well, I can't. Don't come any further. I can't. You locked the She's gate here. behind me, you asshole. Dangerous. Uh, I don't believe that. Let's just... Yep. The force is strong with me. And I'm I'm one with the force, and the force is with me. I smell. Dogs doo-doo, incense, and rotting flesh. Smells like witches, all right. Mm -hmm. Is it my imagination? Or is the light changing? Is it getting darker? Am I going blind? Help! Do you hear voices? I hear voices. 
I don't like disembodied voices. Disembodied voices are never a they're, good sign. They're speaking. It's what's worse than a twisting path into darkness through thorny bushes and sharp naked branches? A swamp. Of course. I feel strange. I felt this way before when I was... when I was in a coma. Inside story time. I must be on the border between waking are those the souls of lost children. If so, this place is even more horrifying than I'd imagined. The only thing stopping me from running in the opposite direction right now the is knowing I'll have to pass gone. through that cave again. But she is here now. She'll eat you up, like she ate all of us. Oh shit. She tricked us. She trapped us. She cooked us. She ate Poor us. Things. Okay. We're the children that never left. It's too late to save us. Save yourself. Weeds and vines Go. covering everything. Is that where the Yaga lives? It looks like a house. I mean, a scary house, sure, but still just a house. Okay. All right. I don't feel in any way certain about what I'm doing. Who bothers me? Who bothers the Yaga? Okay, so maybe not just a house after all. Hi. I can go into the swamp. Wait, I can seriously go into the swamp? Well, that's terrible. <laughs> Oh, shit, it's not a window. It's an eye. Okay, I cannot really go into this one. I cannot look at this window. They're, they're speaking. It's freaky. Can I go into the water with you? I can. Those the souls of lost children. I'm stepping on lost children. If so this place is even okay. more horrifying uh, than I'd imagined. Yeah, this is a creepy house. Okay, so maybe not just a house. You have something that's not yours. Leave, monkey. Not until you give me the soul stone. We do not know what you speak of. Whoa. My whole body's tingling. I can change things. I can manipulate this dream. Cool. Can you? Oh, I have the powers again. I have the powers again. Let's do children. Poor How can I manipulate children? Okay. Uh, there is windows. Can I... Can I even get there? I want to interact with this window. There doesn't seem to be a way for me to get close enough to even look at the window. I just I just have the window as an option. Can I use No, I cannot tell the crow to do anything. That's mind. There are three minds in there. But which one's the Yaga? I can hear several voices, all of them angry. It's so loud, so strong. I can't, I can't keep listening. She's too strong. Oh, it's a hat. No, well, it has eyes, so it's totally a hat. Oh. It's not a hat. We are here at the end of things. I'm just running away now. Oh shit! I want you. Let me go, you bitch! She's away! She's so angry. Reach out! Okay, I opened your mind. Uh, this is 
terrifying. <laughs> I think I need to get through that door. Uh, okay. Do you? Okay, I can stop this. I don't want to fight you. I just want to talk to you. No. Okay. I did get through the door. Oh shit. Okay, just get inside. Alright. Well this this has ta certainly taken a turn. Well <laughs> Wow. Oh, this sucks. Wait, the sky? Is this story time? But it's not like how I remember it. It looks... It's a older. horror story time. It looks a lot older. Can I walk on this? Can I walk at all? Okay, well, let's... Let's walk towards this. I guess, I guess this is the soul stone. you a clever monkey hush sister don't speak to it just let it lose itself in the dark it'll weaken and then we can eat it it'll probably taste honey sweet like it's a map of the north bay. showing the way to cloud do people. not underestimate to this one sisters there's something different about it hello what can i do I wanted something. I want something to interact with. I don't assume walking towards this is going to do any good, seeing as it's an infinite space, and this just gets away from me when I approach it. So, but there's nothing else I could do. I can sprint. Maybe not so clever after all. Well, we're hungry. We need to eat. Not long now. You must be tired, monkey. Your eyes grow heavy. Sleep. We'll watch over you. I'm just gonna walk away. Show yourselves. Okay. I'm not sure that this does anything. There is absolutely nothing. I guess I'm gonna run back. Well, let's see what happens the third time. Is it not asleep yet? Lie down and shut your eyes, monkey. Let us feed. That's not going to happen. It answers back, like a thing with a mind of its own. A very clever monkey. This one has spirit and something else, something powerful. Oh, that's a checkpoint. Well, let's see. I'm gonna persist. I touched it, actually. You're a dreamer. And you're the Wicker Witch of now, the North. Now, there's no need for insults. We are... The Yaga. No monkey has ever been here before. We're curious about you. We? The sisters. Bayeb Ayaga. Well, you are... Bayeb Ayah. Baba Yaga. Baba Yaga. Older than time, older than memory, old as darkness, always three. Cool. Not always, sister. In the beginning, the Yaga was one, and then everything unraveled. 
Light came, worlds were born, monkeys bred and became legion. And the one became three. You are from across the Divide. From a world ruled by machines. That's right. But not really here at all. Dreaming. Apparently so. She looks like a Japanese we mask. Like there that. was only one dreamer. Oh, what's the word? You were mistaken. Something made you. That's interesting. We didn't see this I, coming. We do sure. so love surprises. What do you want from us, monkey? No, hold the on. The soul stone. You stole it. Not Kedamono. Look, stole it Kedamono first. Kedamono is just demon. Only fair that we stole it back. What do you want with it? To bring it back where it belongs. To cure Lux. Lux is the. Lux is the first dreamer. We know. Oh, we know. You cannot teach us things, monkey. We were there in the darkness, in the time before time, before all this terrible brightness, before you monkeys spoiled it. We had the soul stone then. It fed us and made us strong, but Lux took it so that Lux could dream. We were there when Lux dreamed the first dream and the stars were born and everything came apart. If we give you the stone, we fade from memory. We will be forgotten. It's all that anchors us when there's no one left to worship and fear us. But they do worship you, don't they? In the city, they've built effigies to the Wicker Witch. The Wicker Witch! A bedtime story, a spineless fairy tale for nestlings. No one truly fears the Yaga anymore. Our power is diminished. I don't know. People need darkness. They need to be frightened. In my world, scary is popular. There are films, games, haunted houses. Playthings. We are less than we were. We remember feeding, our stomachs bloated with flesh and fear. Well, things change. That's how it goes. Maybe, instead of giving you the soul stone, we eat you up. All your delicious memories. All your dreaming powers. Your soul will keep us warm and sated. How's that gonna help anyone? Help? What makes you think we'll help? We owe the universe nothing, monkey. We owe looks nothing. Why should we care if the dream ends? Perhaps, if you give us a little morsel, a taste of you, what can you offer us? Offer? A sin. A secret. Oh, Something shoot. Dark. Something you keep deep inside and fear to reveal. I... Uh... When Reza and I had our final argument, I let him walk out the door. I didn't try to stop him because... Because I'd already given up. I didn't even... When Mr. London attacked Baruti, I did nothing to help him. I yeah, that's intervened. a good one. I flirted with Roman, and I've never shared that with anyone. So, it's literally the game remembered my sins. Wow, that's cool. I didn't know I could intervene. I didn't know I had a boyfriend. I is there when Reza and I had our final argument, and I, I let him walk out So, it's, none of this I is literally my fault. Because, because I'd already given up. I didn't even give our relationship a chance. Mm. When Mr. Let's do I this. didn't step in to protect a good friend when he was in danger. The monkey fears for its life and hides in shadows. The shame is honey sweet, but not filling, not even a mouthful. Okay. I flirted with Roman and that's giving up. I let is my boyfriend tough, walk out the door and out of my life. I gave up on him and on us. Gutless monkey, afraid to face the truth. The regret is strong. It throbs like a pumping heart. Oh no. A proper morsel, mouth watering. But this satisfies no hunger. We want more. Well, I guess. I flirted with Roman. <laughs> I guess Roman Zelenka comes into play when negotiating with the ancient evil. I flirted with my therapist. <laughs> I wasn't exactly unfaithful, but I, I think I might have been given the opportunity. 
a tiny betrayal, barely a morsel, so small it could never well, be I don't, lost. I don't do anything else. Still, we'll take this little piece of you. It belongs to us now, and you'll have no memory of it. And in exchange, you'll give me the Soul Stone? We will not. We made no promises. The Soul Stone is ours. We need it. If you do that, you'll not only be destroying everything and everyone, you'll be all alone. So they just took Who my sins will away? and fear you when they're all gone? That's cool. So what else can you offer us, monkey? What can you give of yourself to prove that this matters? I don't know. You demand that we give up the thing that feeds us and keeps us warm. And you cannot make a similar sacrifice. You're right. So am I, I supposed can't. to I don't have exchange what you're something for. I love I'm for a soul human. stone? I've See this has terrible <laughs> decisions, but what the hell? I don't linger on those decisions. I move forward and live with the consequences. Shame, anger, disappointment, regret. That's not what feeds me. And honestly, this is way scarier than what happened to Infinity War. I because I let go War. every day. Because I have hope and faith in the future. Not because I look back. That goes for most people. And all I want is to give those people a chance to make their choices. Good or bad. And carry on living and learning. If that's not enough for you, then I have nothing. And if I don't... If I fail to bring the Soul Stone to the first dreamer, Lux dies. The dream ends. There will be no one around to remember any of us, all the choices we've made that brought us here. It all hinges on this moment in time. We know this, little monkey. This is why we are giving you the Soul Stone. But you must do one thing for us in return. Anything, as long as it's mine to give. You must remember us when the dream is in you. The world needs us. Without the sisters, without the Yaga, there is no fear, no imagination. Every dream needs a nightmare. I don't think I could forget, even if I tried. Yes, I'll remember you. Good. 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 Here is the Soul Stone. Take it, use it to wake Lux. We would have done it ourselves, but the Dreamer Monkey is the only one with that power. I got the Soul Stone. How do I get there? Someone's coming. No. Little furry <laughs> thing. They will gift you a beast to ride. Go to Lux. You will feel Lux like a lantern in the dark. Follow the light. Save the dream, Dreamer. Become one with the first. What does that mean? You'll find out. Two, two dreamers become and one. The clever monkey. Beware the wizard of lies. He schemes, he plots. He wishes to remake the world. He wears a mask. He harbors ambitions. He always did. But now, there's something in him. It's a dangerous thing, little monkey. Watch out! Now, leave! Okay... Who is... The Wicked Wizard of Lies? I got an achievement. And I think I got the end of the episode. Well, not yet, clearly, because the cutscene is going on. No, it's not. Where did you disappear to? No. I have a thing about huge monster houses. I don't like them. Oh, you're the worst sidekick. That's what they keep telling me. I honestly don't know why. Let's go back and find the furry little halfling thing again. I bet you he didn't wait for us. I bet you he's long gone. She's letting us go. What did you do? What? We're free. Hey. Time to go. Cool. Thank you, Dreamer. No problem. Find Luke's. I will. Save the dream. Find her, save her. F 
find April. That's what the girl was saying. And the, never mind. Uh, that's retro, another retrospection here. Thanks for watching. This has been a terrifying episode. <laughs> uh, this was good. This has been the right amount of. I'm somewhat a a, a fan of scary. I've literally um, I have literally have two degrees in scary. So I can tell you that this was okay. The right escalation of creepy stuff and then sheer terror of this and then it was good it was good i will see you next time fallout bye bye